So you have probably heard about this program that everybody is talking about when it comes to texturing. It is used for movies, for games and for basically everything involving characters and environment. And you probably want to know what is, what is this all about and this course is probably right for you. My name is Nico and I'm a 3D character artist for more than a decade now. And why I'm doing this with the finger is not important. The thing is that I will show you how to make a good looking textures in Substance Painter, how to start working with Substance Painter and make a metal armor, make a fabric and make all the things you see in this guy there that's rotating and it, it's keeping rotating and rotating. But yeah, we'll make this guy. In this course we will learn exporting the high poly meshes from ZBrush, exporting the low poly mesh from 3D Max, basics of Substance Painter, importing the meshes into Substance Painter, how to bake the textures in Substance Painter, making metal armor material in Substance Painter, playing with dust and scratches, making fabric material, making emissive glowing eyes, exporting textures for Unreal Engine 4, importing the model and textures in Marmoset Toolback, learn all about Marmoset Toolback, rendering our model in Marmoset with lights and making a turntable as a bonus, and for strengthening our skills in Substance Painter and Marmoset Toolback, we'll make a realistic female head and realistic hand baking and texturing. We will start with naming and exporting our high poly meshes from ZBrush. Then we will also name properly and export our low poly mesh from 3ds Max. After that, we will open Substance Painter and we will get to know the basic menus and tools. Then, we will import our low and high poly and learn how to bake the textures in Substance Painter again. When the baking is done, We'll start adding layers and folders to achieve the nice metal armor and cave fabric materials. We will also learn how to experiment with dust and edge wear. We'll then learn how to add an emissive channel and make the eyes glow. Then we will paint manually on our model a custom gold decoration for his armor. After we are happy with our texture, we'll learn how to export textures from Substance Painter with different presets and we'll use the Unreal Engine 4.1. Then we will open Marmoset Toolback and we will learn the basic menu layout and what to do in the program. After that, we'll import our model and textures in Marmoset and make a proper material there. Next, we'll add some lights and go through all menus to make different adjustments and make sure we have the best possible render. We'll also learn how to make a turntable video in Marmoset. As a bonus, and for solidifying our knowledge of Substance Painter and Marmoset Toolback, we will repeat the procedure again with a female head and realistic hand. I have created this course for absolute Substance Painter beginners, so no previous knowledge of either Substance Painter or Marmoset Toolback is required. All the files you will need to go through the course are provided in the Project Files folder, so you don't need any other software if you only want to learn Substance Painter and Marmoset Toolback. So, let's get started.